Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, Tech Enthusiast here and in this video we are going to take a look at the custom Windows image called Rectify 11 and uh, this mod is actually trying to fix the issues in Windows 11 apparently. So here we have the Windows setup and it looks completely different compared to the default Windows 11 installation. And of course the cursor is also changed compared to the default Windows 11 cursor. So this setup basically follows the UI of Windows 11. And uh, right now I'll try to install this um, image on my system and then we are going to take a look at some of the changes developer made in this custom Windows 11 image. So here we are at the Rectify 11 operating system and here as you can see we are on the previous build of Windows 11 which this mod is based on and it's at version 22,318 currently. But I don't know what would happen if you would install install all of these updates because out of the box this specific build comes with updates uh, paused for about I don't know a few years. So I'll pause the updates for now because I don't want to crash Rectify 11 system. So this modification comes with some of the pre-installed application but not a lot because the setup went quite quickly compared to the default Windows 11 installation and also smoothly. So as you can see there isn't Microsoft Edge installed but here we also have the Microsoft Store and as you can see Modern Flyouts also comes out of the box. So if I change the volume you should see that brand new UI of the Modern Flyouts. And this build also comes with some of the themes which are pre-installed. So if I go to the settings, you will see that we have a some of the themes which are quite modified. So here we have, I believe, two modified themes and one I think is removed. And here we have the dark theme which completely changes the UI as well as compared to the default Windows 11 the control panel is actually white but here in this modified version is black and also same goes for the task manager for comparison is also in dark mode and uh, in default one is also in white mode. Then if I select right here the white theme which is also customized it looks something like that and I think these themes are actually made by UX theme patcher so it customizes everything in the windows. So this cursor is also completely changed compared to the default Windows 11 cursor as I talked to you before and it looks quite nice in my opinion but here if I go to the taskbar as you can see we have these brand new three dots at the bottom and you have here your um, icons and if you right click on the taskbar, here you will see that you have an option to cascade windows. And if you go here to the properties, you'll see that you have a lot more options to play with. So I think that it's really unfortunate that this build doesn't come with an option that you can move the taskbar, for example, to the left, to the right or to the top. Only the bottom is the option. But here you have some of the options that you can style or customize your taskbar by uh, your preference. So here you can change the taskbar style from, for example, Windows 11 to the Windows 10. And uh, then you also have an option show search button, show task view button and all of these options. But one thing is also interesting that if you go to the personalization and then here to the taskbar, that one option is removed which is called widgets, but here it is actually unavailable. So I think this is because the Microsoft Edge is also uninstalled and there is no web view to actually update this widget. So I think this is why it is removed. So if you go to the properties once again, here you have some of the options. So you have an option to show the weather, but you will need to have a Windows 10 taskbar, which you can completely change right here. And then if you restart File Explorer, I think the change should be made. And as you can see, the taskbar File Explorer is looking like the Windows 10. So this custom image of Windows Rectify 11 also comes with pre-installed application called the Rise MP Pre Alpha 4 
and uh, this is basically a replacement uh, song player a replacement for the groove music player that comes pre-installed with the default windows 11 and it looks something like that so you can actually play the music with this program uh, if you want to and I think it's a also quite nice looking UI that the developer actually made this specific application that slick and also one thing that if you go to the control panel itself here I'll go to the uninstaller program and here you can see which programs are actually installed so 7-zip chromium as a default web browser as well as microsoft edge redirect which would probably redirect every single html link or web website link to the chromium browser and then we also have ultra ux theme patcher which allows you for patching the themes which are heavily modified by the developer and this is basically the custom operating system or custom image of windows 11 which strives for better ur and whole dark mode experience so i think this is pretty much it for today um if you enjoy the content maybe subscribe to the channel and also like this video for the youtube algorithm would be much appreciated and i'll also put a link down below in video description if you want to try this lightweight or customized version of windows 11 by yourself it's completely free and if you scroll down a bit on this official website where you can get it you have three links to download from and it's completely safe to use. Thank you for watching and see you guys in the next video. Peace.